Ring in the new year with amazing savings from Appalachian Wireless. Get the Galaxy S7 for just $49.99 when you sign or renew a two-year service agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Last month, while attempting to rescue a couple of young abandoned horses in Breathitt County, Curtis Bostick was arrested and charged with felony theft of livestock. Those charges have since been dropped, but Bostick has chosen to use the attention from the case to educate the public on a growing problem in our region. In eastern Kentucky, there is a horse problem. Over the years, they have turned their horses out to forge for themselves in the wild. Those horses have become wild and they have multiplied. Officials with several agencies, including Kentucky Department of Fish and Wildlife, acknowledge the problem exists and is growing. Some estimates suggest as many as 3,000 feral horses are living on reclaimed surface mines, but Bostick says a Kentucky law has empowered people like him who want to help. Our, our state legislature is trying to fix that, but people don't know that they have a right to go help. Bostick is referring to KRS 259-110. The first step in that process um, as I understand it, is that if an animal is outside of its enclosure, a horse is outside of its enclosure, that you can go and take it up. You can, you can rescue it. Bostick and his family plan to return to Breathitt County soon to complete their rescue mission. And he says he hopes to see similar efforts at other locations throughout the region. I would love to see as many of those animals as can find good homes to be placed. Of course, there are specific guidelines that need to be followed, and notifying your local law enforcement agency of your rescue intentions is suggested. Reporting in Breathitt County for EKB News, I'm Shannon Deskins.